Hello, my name is Andreas Trögenmüller and I'm Product Line Manager for Linear Guides at Evelix. And today I want to demonstrate you the preload adjustment of Evelix linear ball bearing units. Evelix linear ball bearings do have a raceway design and with the raceway design where on this picture example we have six race space under above the balls the operating clearance of such a linear ball bearings bearing is defined by the shaft and the housing that gives the optimum of performance of a bearing on the other side sometimes it's necessary besides the standard design of a bearing unit to have a slotted unit where the preload can be adjusted by the user in the application. On this picture we, I have chosen the LUCE design where we have uh, a slotted housing with the adjustable screw on the bottom of this picture. But then let's go to the practical design and the function. Today I have brought with me this alignment of a linear slide where I have two shafts, four shaft blocks, four units, only as a demonstrator and I will put the mobile phone on it and when moving the mobile phone on the units I have the total function of a linear slide. To demonstrate the adjustment of a unit, I have here the two different designs. One design is a standard design, second design is a slotted design, both are standard in our assortment. And on a standard design, we do have slight clearance by our manufacturing. On the slotted design, if it's not turned with the tightening screw, it's the same. You do feel slight clearance of the unit. And slight clearance means you can turn the bearing around the shaft when moving. To demonstrate the adjustable function, I'm dismounting the second bearing. I will take the screwdriver, put it on the adjustable screw and try to find the first resistance of the screw. First resistance on the screw, I can still turn the bearing, but I feel a s bigger resistance of the turning. I can even do it a bit more for finding a real preloaded function. It still can be turned around but heavily. I would say this is a maximum point of pr a preloaded linear ball bearing. Don't do it too much because if you turn it too much the bearing is not even able to turn and you feel the resistance and the noise. Go back, go to the right position from the beginning for the first resistance where you still can turn it slightly and then it's the right preloaded function. That should give you a first advice how to use the slotted units with Evelix linear ball bearings. I will mount the things again together, turn it around, move it down to get to the same position. Now I have to adjust the bearing in the right position. And then the one bearing beside the others is preloaded and a more rigid and stiffer slide unit is created 
if all four would be chosen as a unit in slotted design. Thank you for listening and have a great day.